wait, wait, wait. Uh-huh. Bounce, 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 bounce. Yeah. Bounce, bounce. Very point this. Uh-huh. Bounce, bounce. Damn, my free, free. But damn, don't see me, see me. On the low, low, steady, kind of easy. Welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to be sharing a highly requested video and that's about my natural hair and how I have kept it very thick and healthy. So I'm basically going to be sharing my routine and how that has worked for me in the past eight, in the past nine months because I actually started this routine about nine months ago. So let's get started. So before I start, I'm going to tell you guys that I've been natural for five years and in those five years I've cut my hair three times. The last time I cut my hair was in January 2016. So this hair is actually a year and five months if I'm not mistaken. But I started doing this new routine about nine months ago. So what is it that I do? Basically it's really really simple. I wear my wigs for three months. And then I let my hair, my natural hair breathe for three weeks and I repeat the whole process all over again. And because of this routine, my hair has grown so long and so thick and <clears throat> I've also noticed that I don't share a lot of hair that much anymore. And this is basically because I don't manipulate my hair every day and that's going to reduce sh hair shedding. This routine has really, really helped keep my hair in a very healthy state and also the length the growth rate has very has increased in the past nine months so when my hair is under the wig it's braided back what do i do i make sure that my hair is washed and is kept moisturized guys this is so important make sure you wash your hair regularly and make sure you keep your hair moisturized this is something I didn't take serious in the past and I had to learn the hard way and trust me since I started doing this regular base I've seen my hair change in the health like my hair has become really healthy so basically under even though my I wear my wigs I make sure that I wash my hair every other two weeks so basically I wash my hair twice a month shouldn't do it a lot also it's too much is also not good but too little is also not good so you need to find a number that fits what you can do sometimes I do it three times a month but most of the time I do it twice a month so I wash my head twice um, every other two weeks even though when I'm wearing my wig and then I moisturize my scalp I really really make sure I moisturize my scalp because trust me guys your hair needs moisturize needs to be moisturized for it to grow because if it's too dry it will just break and it will just fall off so that's something that I do that has helped a lot moving on to uh, the products that I use I don't use that much product I like I said I used to do a lot of I used to be a natural hair product junkie I got a lot of product and most of them didn't work for me so I finally figured out a product that worked for me and yes guys it is my coconut oil guys this is bit right yeah like I use this product for my skin I use it for taking off my makeup and I use it mostly mostly for my hair this is 100% by the way and I apply this this is the product I use to moisturize my hair another oil that I use is this Monois oil I'm going to put the name in the description also all the products below so you can go check them and I mainly use this for my scalp when my hair is on when my hair is like braided to the back so it's easy for me to just like moisturize my scalp with this oil so basically these are the two main products that I use for my hair and this is what works for me I know right it's it's really not a rocket science Another tip that I've noticed that have worked for me is I usually will comb my hair dried and you, you know the struggle of combing your hair when it's dried it's painful and then you also share a lot of hair I realized that it's not good for you so now when I want to detangle my hair I mainly do it under the shower when I'm taking when I'm washing my hair so when my hair is wet that's when I comb it and that really helps a lot to reduce your hair shedding so that's also another tip 
that I will give to you that I do as well and when my hair is out I try not to do too much to it I try to put a style that will last me for a whole week so I don't need to manipulate my hair that much so those are really basically all the things that I do and the routine that I have kept in the, that I've been keep that I've been doing for the past nine months that have worked for me and right now I should be going to quickly show you guys how um, I prepare my hair because I'm about to start wearing my wigs now because I've been leaving my natural hair for the past actually I left my hair longer this time I left almost four weeks so I need to go back to wearing my wigs actually starting from tomorrow so I need to prepare my cornrow and right now I've pre-washed my hair this morning I think my hair is now about 90% dry but I'm just going to blow dry it and then I'm going to cornrow it and then it's moisturize my scalp again and then I'm ready to wear my wig I already moisturized my hair so it is my hands are like very oily so my hair it's properly moisturized and right now I'm just going to blow dry my hair and I'm going to do that sections by section because if not it's just gonna be a huge My hair braided corn roll I mean and it's ready for my wig so this is what I and this braids normally last me sometimes when it's getting loose I just loose my braid and then redo the redo the corn roll but they mostly last me to two months yeah that's the um, that's the video for today I hope you guys love this video I hope the tips and my routine is going to be helpful to anyone that might be interested and leave your comment below if you're going to try this and also leave a comment below if you have other things that you've been using and that's been working out for you there's always love in sharing probably there'll be someone that might try your method and it might work for them but yeah I hope you guys love it and tell me if you guys love this kind of videos so I will make another one i sure to like share comment and subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed yet thank you guys so so much and we will see you guys in our next video bye my hands hurt my hands hurt from all this brady struggle of these lashes. Okay, I have to clean up.